And this is a family affair here, as Thanksgiving uh, means so many to all of us, families from across the country here to see those giant balloons up close. Jessica Moore on the Upper West Side with some special people in life. Hi, Jessica. <laughs> Hey, Mo and KJ. It is the pre party out here, and I'm joined by my mini correspondents, Nico and Coco. Coco's especially excited to be out here on this freezing cold night, but hey, they've got their Channel 2 hats on. So, Nico, what do you think about the balloons? It's great. Which one's your favorite one, do you think? Hippopotamus. The hippopotamus? Yeah. And you've never seen these balloons before, have you? Yeah. Well, that was the case for a lot of people we met today, and it turns out that this event did not disappoint. Get everybody together. Pure joy from kids of all ages as they watch the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade balloons come to life. Baby Yoda and Pikachu. I enjoy Thanksgiving. I came here because I just got back from a deployment, so I'm just here to take my wife. It's off our bucket list. It's like awesome. It's like it's almost like they're actually like like coming to, up to life. Is this like one of the best days of your life? Yes. Jeff Krensick planned the surprise of a lifetime for his three children from Tampa, Florida. They're huge, and the energy of the city is just great. The people are great, and uh, being here in person is nothing like seeing it on TV. This year's parade will feature 15 giant character balloons, 36 inflatables, 28 floats, 800 clowns, and 8,000 marchers. We live in the neighborhood, and this is a great tradition. It's incredibly magical. What about this versus coming to the actual parade? There's something different about this. Yeah, huh? it's a little bit more intimate, and there's something really transformational about seeing them grow right before your eyes, and then you get to see them on TV the next morning. Rising TV star, two year old Poppy, spotted one of this year's six new balloons Pikachu and Eevee. Like the money. It's a bunny. Can you say it again? Well, what's it? So we should mention that everyone out here had to be vaccinated, 12 and older. And if you still want to come out, you still can. This is open until 6 p.m. Nico, can you say one more thing for me? All right. Can you say Christine and Maurice back to you? No. Can you say <laughs> Mo and KJ back to you? No. <laughs> Mo and KJ. No. No. Uh, we're feeling you. No. We're feeling you. Mo and KJ. That's good. Oh, that's pretty good. Good job, Bubs. Aww. All right, guys, we'll see you back here again at 6 o'clock. Okay, <laughs> Thank Jess. you. Thanks, Love it. Jessica. Family time is nothing better. I know. To paraphrase Mike Tyson, everybody has a plan until the kids start crying. That's right. That's <laughs> right. right. They've got their own timeline, don't they? They sure do. <laughs> if you can't make it out to the balloon inflation, you can watch our special tonight, Thanksgiving Eve, a celebration with Lonnie Quinn and Jessica Moore. They'll both be out there. It's streaming live tonight on CBSN New York at 7 p.m. And here's a look at the parade route for tomorrow. Begins at 77. Street and Central Park West makes its way down CPW to Columbus Circle, then a left onto Central Park South, and then a right down 6th Avenue all the way to Herald Square. And you can watch the parade right here on CBS2 tomorrow. Coverage starts at 9 o'clock in the morning.